was a hot, humid night in Herzliya Pitua, an affluent area north of Tel Aviv that is home to several foreign ambassadors. Here at the garden of the German ambassador's home, a diverse crowd of people from nuns to African ambassadors have arrived to celebrate 70 years of the State of Israel and to taste a new German-Israeli friendship beer, an idea sponsored by the German embassy and brought to fruition through the partnership of an Israeli brewery and its German counterpart. Johannes Faust is the owner of Faust Brewery in Miltenburg, established in 1654. We love to brew beer and we are happy and I am happy to be here now because it's my first time here in Israel. Um, great, great to be here with Ori and uh, great to, to drink uh, this beer. I'm happy. Ori Sagi is the founder and brewmaster of Alexander Beer, established a decade ago in Israel. The beer scene in Israel today is new, is young, but uh, beer is done in the Middle East for about 4,000 or more years, so it's not uh, quite uh, new to the region. And though the brew has only just debuted, it already has people talking. In Germany, a lot of people asked me, if, is it possible to, to buy this beer in, in Germany? And uh, I always had to say, no, not in the moment, maybe in the future. But I hope so. <laughs> and in the nature of a true partnership, the special brew combines flavors unique to each country. The idea was to uh, make, uh, to take a, a style of German beer. We took the Fest style, which is common to Oktoberfest. And we made the uh, Israeli twist to it together. Uh, Cornelius, which is a, a much more experienced brewmaster than myself, came to my brewery. We uh, developed the recipe together by phone and emails and, you know, a lot of chats. We added to this beer Israeli wheat, which is not a common um, ingredient in, uh, in a German fest beer. Following our discussion with the brewmasters, we walked around the garden to find out what the visitors think about the beer. I'm from almost from Bavaria, so I can say it's very good. It's a tasty beer. It has a very specific taste. You can feel a strong taste of the malt. I think it has great potential. But not everyone was impressed. I don't know. I don't know. We have so different beers here. We have here Gold Star. We have uh, imported beers. Uh, Carlsberg, especially, it's uh, more bitter. And this is more sweet. I don't know. The evening was also used as an opportunity to bid farewell to German ambassador Dr. Clemens von Goetze, who has completed his three-year term in Israel. We had a very interesting time here and that we ended with a even evening where we can drink beer that has been brewed commonly by a German and an Israeli brewer, that's the right end of, this, of, of the three years. Prost, Lechaim, Daniel Campos, I-24 News. Cheers. Cheers.